Hello everyone, my name is Sparky Boy. Today we're going to be doing a Fortnite ranking video. Today we're going to be ranking all the Chapter 2 Season 2 Battle Pass skins of 2020. Uh, I hope y'all enjoy. Uh, please subscribe to support the channel and I would greatly appreciate it. Um, share this video with your friends and uh, let's just get right into it. Now, um, I'm not going to be ranking any of the backlings, any of the sets that come with it. I'm just going to be ranking the soul skin. Uh, I'm not going to be doing the styles or anything. This is just going to be a simplified, because I don't want to really make this a, like, very confusing video. But I will do, like, an updated version where I did the backlings and stuff in the future. But that probably won't be season two. Maybe, like, season three or four, um, if we ever get to that point before you know fortnite dies uh but um yeah so uh we're gonna start with number seven uh i counted them they were uh yeah i know i i can't count but um <laughs> sorry my mom's in the background yelling number seven let's start with agent peely now agent peely isn't that i keep you i keep getting added in group chats my bad um so now, Peely will always be a favorite, my favorite skin. I'm sad I didn't get a PS4 during Season 8 because I would have bought the Battle Pass and I would have got Peely. Oh my god. But this is kind of a little bit of a remorseful feeling, but we're not going to get into my personal experience. We're just going to go with my opinion. And this skin, let's just be honest, it's Peely in a suit. It's not that interesting. I mean, I'm glad Peely got him some new ta some uh, new tux. I mean, he's... He, if I think about it, he, he's been naked, this is, like, in his first game, he's been naked, so, you know, I'm glad he finally got some clothes, um, but, uh, this is just not an interesting skin, I don't enjoy it, and I believe some of my friends don't enjoy it, maybe some of them do, but I rarely see anyone wearing this skin anymore, so, yeah, uh, number six, we're gonna go with, uh, Maya's Default, now, um, I, wa I want y'all to hear this. I do want you to hear this. A default. We're not talking about any of the styles y'all made them. We're talking about the standard default skin. And it's literally a default skin. <laughs> I mean, it looks okay, I guess? The only reason I'm ranking it higher than Agent Peely is just because I'm a simple person. And I personally wore the skin a little bit more than Peely. Um, but I would still never wear the skin, even if my life depended on it. So, I'm, it's a bit better than Peely. Uh, I know some people may not agree with me, because everyone, everyone likes to praise Lord Peely. But I like Maya a little bit more than Agent Peely. But not as much as the actual Peely, if that makes sense. I'm sure it does to y'all. But, um, number six is gonna go to Brutus. No, he's just some generic bodyguard. He ain't that interesting. But, I, I don't like his hitbox. I don't like his, um, I don't like his whole story about him. He's just a bodyguard from Midas. But, dang, dude, I, I don't know why, but this skin is just, it's just kind of okay. I mean, it's better than Maya's. It's, I'm sure it's a bit more, it's, I'm sure it's more generic than Maya or Peely, or probably, it's less generic, I would say, not more generic, but, um, I really like this skin, and I normally never wear it, but even if my life depended on it, I would wear it, because I do like the skin, and I do think it's interesting, I think they could have done a bit more with it, but that's just my opinion, um, uh, number four is gonna be Meowsles. Now, I would rank Meowsles so low, but one thing that kept me back f from it is Epic tried to do something. They tried to mix up the skins. They don't want to repeat the same thing over and over again, unless it's a popular skin and they do a spin-off of it, like Peely, or like uh, Bright Bomber, or um, <sighs> Bright Bomber. I'm sure there's a third one that I can't remember, but um, I like I like the animal skins. A lot of them have really large hitboxes, but Meowsles is just, is he's such an interest, like, I'm glad they tried to do something different, and I wouldn't say they failed, but I do say, but I would say he, they, they like, they failed, 
but they they didn't fail but they didn't hit it just right if i would if that makes sense um so it, it's it is an interesting skin um yeah sorry <laughs> um that's probably gonna interrupt like the video a bit like one or two more times but um yeah i i do enjoy the skin even if it's a bit interesting um or a bit of a generic skin but i like it i'm a fan of cats but it's not as good as the dog skin. I'm sorry, but I love the dog skin with the hoodie way more than a bodyguard cat. So, yeah. Uh, number three was a very tough pick. Uh, cause I like both of these skins. But number three is gonna go to Sky. No, I love Sky. I love the story behind her. It's like she's just, she's just you know an adventure girl. But other than that, there's really nothing to her. Um. I mean, her, I mean, she has a hat that turns into a glider and an emote. That, that ain't that interesting. Um, she just, she just, she just looks like every other skin ever. Like in my opinion, that that's her ghost version. My bad. Um, I just, I think she just looks a bit more generic than usual. But I still really enjoy her, and I, w I would, I would wear this skin. about that guys um so uh yeah we're gonna um <laughs> i keep i keep forgetting i keep forgetting my freaking script i don't even have a script uh we were gonna go on to teen tina um number th two is gonna be teen tina uh this skin is just i mean some people would say it's generic it's just some g lady that likes to blow stuff up but like she for me she was a really good skin and i love the skin uh i'm personally not a big fan of her default i would say something else is a bit better her other things are a bit better but still i really enjoy this and i think it is a pretty good skin but y'all know who number one is it's it's midas okay look I know this is so cliche for having the tier 100 skin as number one, but there's some tier 100 skins that are really good, and this one is no exception. I personally not a big fan of any gold characters. I don't, I don't, I just like normal generic. I don't like skins that try to flex or skins that make everyone look sweaty or something like that. But this skin, I can make an exception for this skin because it's just. It's just a dude with a with some tats, and he can turn stuff golden, and that's kind of cool. And I severely like the skin. Bad things about the skin? Well, um, his I'm not a big fan of his default thing. I personally like his where he's fully gold, and but he sells the suit, like his ghost or shadow version. But for his default, it's still very good. But if we were ranking styles, I wouldn't put this as number one. So, yeah, I like this. I think it's really good. And it's probably the best skin of this battle pass, in my opinion. But I hope you all enjoyed today's video. Please subscribe and like if you enjoyed this video. You probably...